medicine, it's come a long way. Back in the Middle Ages, doctors would cover you in leeches at the first sign of just about any illness. And the less said about mercury injections, the better. Fast forward 500 years and we've got hospitals. Big shiny buildings full of doctors, nurses and hospital pharmacists. Who? Hospital pharmacists, that's who. Hospitals simply couldn't function without highly trained and highly skilled hospital pharmacists. Try and imagine a hospital without medicine. It's like imagining a library without books. Or a restaurant without food. Hospital pharmacists produce personalised medicines, allowing for specific and individual treatment for every patient. They have face-to-face -face meetings with patients to ensure they understand all the important aspects of the medication they are taking. Hospital pharmacists are also involved with cutting-edge clinical trials, treatments for rare diseases, emergency medicines, cancer treatments and many, many other areas of health in the hospital setting. In short, hospital pharmacists make sure that the hospital has the right medicines for the right patients at the right time and that these are administered in the right way. They ensure that at all hours of the day and night, patients in the hospital wards have the medicines they need. Working with doctors and nurses, the hospital pharmacist helps to make sure patients get the right care and treatment. But hospitals and pharmacies, like everything in the modern world, do not stand still. Changes are constant and the profession in Europe is dedicated to ensuring it plays its full part in the continuous improvement of treatment standards and the achievement of new levels of success in terms of patient outcomes. And that's why the European Association of Hospital Pharmacists is calling a summit. Everyone who comes to the summit will help us to set out the future direction of the profession, how it can further serve the patient and enhance collaboration with other health professionals. We want to highlight and learn from all the good practice initiatives achieved in hospital pharmacies across Europe so that during the summit we can create improvement tools and roadmaps that can turn aspirations of improvement into reality and agree a set of competencies and roles for hospital pharmacists to achieve in every European country. Everything a hospital pharmacist does has the end goal of helping the patient and in the hospital context this always has and always will be a team effort. With this in mind we're inviting patients, the public, nurses, doctors and other clinical staff to come along and get involved.